What's up guys? It's Monday, Interesting Fact Monday, and today is May 4th. It's Star Wars Day. May the 4th be with you. I'm not, my fingers are too fat for that shit. I can't do it. May the 4th. There we go. No, that's not it. May the 4th be with you! The term, may the 4th be with you, was actually a fluke. It was an accident. There are two theories of where may the 4th be with you came from. The first idea is that in 2005, there was a German news TV show and they were talking about Star Wars and they tried to translate the line, may the force be with you, and it translated to, we will be with you on the fourth. The second conspiracy theory has something to do with Margaret Thatcher and it was like a whole article about it. It got boring. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't read it. For the first organized celebration of Star Wars Day, that's gonna like become a thing. <laughs> Star Wars Day, okay. Star, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. One more time. Star Wars Day. Okay, so the first organized celebration of Star Wars Day happened in 2011 in Ontario, Canada. There were costume contests and people did remixes and parodies and mashups of Star Wars things and there was this big trivia game. I didn't go, but from the pictures and articles I read, it looked like it was phenomenal. So what did people do on National Star Wars Day? Well, people dress up in costumes and walk around town looking like we're at Megacon, <laughs> binge watch Star Wars movies, or play Star Wars Monopoly with your best friends. Now here are a couple side facts that actually make May 4th being Star Wars Day. Not really a bad idea. First of all, George Lucas was born in May. May 14th, not May 4th, which is Star Wars Day. But just May 14th. All six live action Star Wars movies came out in May. May 4th begins the Walt Disney World Resort Star Wars Week. Star Wars Days, which ends up turning into a week of performances and meet and greets and fast pass passes and things like that. Everything Star Wars, because you guys know Disney did buy Lucas Entertainment in 2012. So that's pretty much it of all the facts I could find about Star Wars Day. In the comments below, tell me what you're doing to celebrate Star Wars Day. And please make sure you subscribe to this video. There, sh there should be like a little green subscribe word. Click it and subscribe now. I'll wait. On Tuesday, my friends Jenna and Nico and I did the two truths and a lie tag. If you want to see that video, click here. And then last Monday's interesting fact video, I talked about National Sexual Assault Month. If you want to see that video, keep calm and click the pink box. And remember, a thumbs up means you like me, and a subscribe means you love me. And I love you too. I'll see you guys next time.